I don't know about you, but I really love making coordinating outfits for me and my kid. Uh, I just think it's the cutest thing ever. And so I wanted to show you one of the most recent things that I've made for the two of us. I'm Mari with Mari Sews and welcome back. You know, there was one point where I remember telling people, I mean, I told everybody, I selfishly sew, I do not sew for other people. And even when my kid was born, I was like, nah, they grow so quickly, it's not worth sewing for little kids. Man, things have changed so much because now I love any opportunity that I get to actually make us coordinating outfits. And the most recent thing that I made actually are um, some Dolman sweaters from Lowland Kids. So if you guys aren't familiar with Lowland Kids patterns, uh, they do a lot of really cute patterns, a lot of adorable little girl stuff, a lot of knit clothing, but um, they're expanding out into adult sizes too. And so what's cool was they had this little tiny dolman tee um, pattern for children. And I guess it was so popular, they decided to make it for adults as well. So here's the tee that I made him. Um, and I know I just called it a t-shirt. It's not a t-shirt, it's totally a sweatshirt. <laughs> this is his little Dolman sweatshirt. Um, it has tiny little grown on sleeves. You can see it right here. You see where that seam is. And then the sleeve is actually one piece. Um, however, I did this little stripe technique with some faux suede there. Oh, I feel so nice. Um, the fabric itself is a wool knit that I picked up from Fabric Mart online during one of their sales. And um, yeah, I mean, this, this thing, this little thing is a size 4T and it came together super quickly. I mean, from printing out the PDF patterns, I mean, you all know, I do not like taping together all them papers to make PDF patterns. But th this thing is so small, seriously. It took me an hour and a half from tape <laughs> to finishing this thing. And um, it fits him really nicely. I'll throw some pictures in here for you. Okay, so let me show you mine. So this is the Lowland Kids Women's Dolman pattern that they had. And you can see, I actually opted to do the sleeve part right here in a faux suede. And the entire thing's a faux suede. The reason why I didn't do my son's the same exact way is because I just didn't have <laughs> enough, uh, enough of the suede for it. So I cut up this little sleeve and I put in that stripe. And I'll show you guys how I do that in another video in case you're interested. Um, this top actually comes with um, a lot of different length variations. So you can do like a more cropped look or a longer look. And then it also came with a full band like the children's one. Now this is upside down, but you see it's there's like no breaks in it. It's just a full band. Or you could do the split band, which is my preference. And so you can see right there, there's that split band with the back being a little longer. I really love this pattern. I think this pattern is hands down a winner. And I mean, like, <laughs> how, could it, how could it go wrong? I mean, come on, who doesn't love to like match somebody. You can match your kid. You can match the grandkids. You can match the neighbor's kids. You can match all of the neighborhood kids. You can have, I don't know. I, I know you probably don't wanna sew for that many people, but I'm just saying that these things come together really quickly. I made them entirely at my serger. That's a lie. I did both of these sweaters primarily on my serger. And I think that's the reason why it really took no time at all. And I honestly see more of these in my future because they're just, they're so comfortable. So let me just show you a few more pictures.
Okay, well, that's a Lolan Kids Dolman sweater. Um, and in case you're interested, I'll put the link to the patterns in the um, description box below. They don't pay me <laughs> to promote them, but I really do. I really do like this pattern a lot. <laughs> well, if you're still hanging with me, thank you so much. Uh, please give me a thumbs up, subscribe, and hit that bell notification so that way you know the next time that there's a new video posted. I try to post a couple of times a week, and when I do, you'll know when there's a new video. Well, until next time, I hope that you have a wonderful day. Bye.